If you are a real gentleman, go to Tools for Gents. Where you can buy real unique knives. Oh, hi there, folks. I was just working on my new house with my, you know, my EDC knife. Because that is what I do with my EDC knife. Work on houses. Haha. <laughs> Everybody laugh. Listen, um, it's going to be a nice and relaxing video where we hopefully don't break knives because this video is going to be about our own knives, the knives that we actually carry every day. Falcon even TK3. Nice. Which is my ooh, mother of pearl, yeah. It is your EDC. This is my EDC. I use it, I absolutely use it every day. Oh, hey, hey, I'm just working on, uh, on the new Kruk. Uh, <laughs> but this is my EDC knife. This is also a Falcon even Mickey. And you know why this literally became my EDC? Because I gave it to you. You gave this to me, Mickey. And uh, here I, is your I, birthday present. I kind of know this box. I know what it is. I get a little bit emotional. Yeah, yeah. They are t shirts. <laughs> <laughs> no, joking. There what is, is this. I bought Martin a nice Felk Neven knife. Oh, no. What? How did you keep this a secret? With, with, with pain in my heart, and it was very difficult to keep it a secret. That's why Holy I, was, I kept shit. telling you, oh shit, I don't know what birthday present to buy you, but no way. I spoke with Eric of Falk Neven, and I really wanted to have a great knife for you. Oh man, <laughs> what the hell? It is true convex, which I really love. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit of a bulky boy, and it's 3G steel, Mickey, which is kind of strange, because for bushcraft uh, survival knives, we always, don't really recommend 3G steel because it's a little bit brittle. But for EDC, Mickey, I think advertising is really good. Hey, and you had like the first test. Normally it would be how, car, how sharp does it come from the factory? And now we have to do the first test. Yeah. How sharp do we actually keep our knives? Yeah, how sharp do we carry them? So you haven't sharpened your knife at all since I gave no, it to it, you. And that is in October. So this is, this is very white. Okay. Oh, okay. That still shaves pretty good. Okay. Ooh. Whoa! <laughs> you are just casually standing there. And <laughs> well, we have just tested your knife to be the sharpest knife that we have ever tested on that thing. Yeah. That is ridiculous. And you have not stropped it. You have only stropped it from the factory. I have only stropped it. I have, I, I opened my mailbox with it. <laughs> mailbox? Yeah. You pry it <laughs> <I> open. Just... <laughs> Here we go. Oh, that is not bad. 151? Whoa, I also did not expect that. You, Mickey, yesterday you told me, okay, but I gotta sharpen this before yeah. the video. I said, no, we're gonna see how sharp we actually carry these knives. But let, let me see how it is after DBK combat. Ooh, that's 20 off. This is what I call true convex. This is like, like I. This is the same as like a Falcon even F1 would do, which is a brilliant feather stickers. Oh yes, yes. Honestly, I have not even ever made a feather stick with this knife before. This one did come with a V edge, and you gave it a, a, a convex. Whoa. That's not just a convex, that's a very shiny convex. Yeah. Okay, that might be even better than mine. Well, I, I have to give this like at least an eight and a half, maybe yeah. even a, a nine, maybe. Just, no, an eight and a half. Gotta be honest, this does feel like you're holding a polar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, with the mine, you have more feeling that you're holding a but fixed the blade. the smoothness through the wood. Yeah, that is amazing. Sound like this? Yeah, let's try that. And suddenly this video took a very dark turn. I spoke to the people of Falkneven and they told me to absolutely not baton with this knife. I bought this 500 euro knife myself and we are on a knife breaking streak. Oh, I feel it so good. Oh, it feels so bad. It feels so bad. It's 
So viewers, I really hope that you are entertained by us. So this is such a nice little channel. Look, bushcraft skills from Bushcraft Boy. Yeah. And it's not over now. Because now I have to see if it is still in perfect condition because this knife is made to be absolutely perfect. is almost endlessly better than mine. Okay, that actually felt pretty all right to do. And you know, this is just not a lock that you want to baton because this can bend oh, exactly Christ. like this. Uh, okay. Especially liner locks. Definitely not made for batoning. We thought of a nice little challenge for these two totally different knives. Mart and I had to prepare wood for a fire that we then had to light as fast as possible. The winner gets a whole buttload of honor. Martin could baton small pieces of wood, but the sad thing is, my knife can't baton. So I had to solve that some other way, otherwise I would lose again. again. So the deal is, two of these big blocks have to go and burn. First one to have his fire going wins. And he has to do he has to do this to the camera. Okay, that's the winning. That's that's the stopping phase. Okay. We don't even know how these scraper fires do, do we? No. I know that mine is pretty good at scraping a fire. Shoot. Okay. Can so, I test? Shall I test mine? Ooh, mine is really good. That is really good. <laughs> Yeah, yours is really good. Really good. I don't see how I have enough of everything. Yeah, me neither, me neither. How, how do you, what do you mean? You have all this, I don't have that. No, that's true, but okay. We're gonna say start and then we're gonna start the timing. So we've got a little time to prepare now. Okay, I'm done preparing. You have way more feather sticks than I. Okay, three, two, one, go. There we go. There we go, yo. There we go, yo. Hey. Mijn wil gewoon geen vuistjes geven meer. Nee, nee. Yo, 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 yo. Nee, de mijne wil niet. Yo, here we go. Yo, here we go. Yo, here we go. Yo, here we go. Yo, 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 vlieg. Ow, burn my hand. Always good. Okay, stop. Okay, for me also stop. Oh, you're, yeah. you're, yeah, I stopped first. <laughs> I was still thinking you didn't even have a fire. Yeah. What's that? So I really hope that this is gonna burn because I didn't have anything. I just had to put everything, just throw it on there. But you know what is strange? Is I just, the last thing I heard is I cannot get a spark. And then <laughs> the next thing I heard is stop. <laughs> <laughs> and you say, I also stop. No, then you just lose. <laughs> hey, but we have to see if yours lights. Yo, here we go. Yo, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I was not even watching you because I thought you were just failing miserably. <laughs> hey. And I was just taking my sweet time. <laughs> let's give this, let's give this 20 more seconds. See what happens. Hey, 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 the wind is picking up. And there we go. Yo, here we go. I want to yeah. hear, you know what I want to hear? What the comment section is thinking right now. Look, a fire is a fire, yeah? Okay. Let me put this in your house, see if you think this is a fire, yes or no. I win, I win, ladies and gentlemen. There's no dis no discussing about it. That is a fire. The winning, man, the winning, Dan. <laughs> To be honest, I didn't even know that we're gonna cook something. But then Martin had a little surprise for me, even though I won. Yeah. 
Uh, we're gonna cook something. And well, that's... You, you need all of that. But this is about 40 or 50 euros? Yeah, not that expensive, but it's expensive. It's good. But like from everything that we have ever cooked on this channel, I think this is the best thing that we ate yeah. up to now. Hey, and we gotta slice it. Maarten, what are you doing? Maarten, what are you doing? There's one in the fire there! Jezus! Mm. Maarten, what was that? I, will, I was just thinking. <laughs> hey, I don't have my glove, so I will just give this a few little pounds to get it a bit lower. <laughs> then the whole thing came my down. My god, what a casta catastrophe! Okay, well this one is already turned. Yeah. This one is already turned. <laughs> this one is already turned. <laughs> It's time. It Don't looks really good. Shall we just eat it and do the conclusion? Yeah, remember, remember because I cannot like breathe and eat at the same time. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah nice. But we can, we can try, we can try. My favorite piece of meat. Oh, yeah, so tender. Oh my God. From all the pieces of meat that we had on this channel, this is the best. Yeah. It is so juicy, so tender. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mickey, we are giving away the Rockstead Ritzu. Wow. That is a 1700 euro knife that we're giving away. Yeah, we're thanks to Tools for Gents. We're also giving away the Falkneven NL5 in VG10W. Thanks to DBK, we're also giving away the Falkneven F1 Shield. We are giving away CVP Elementum. And we are giving away the Vuben A62, which is a flashlight with a knife inside. Hey, but why are we carrying these? Because for me, that's simple, because uh, there's a big reason you gave it to me, yeah, okay. which gave it a bigger meaning. I think it's really amazing to have this, almost like, this is the best like synthetic uh, replica of ivory yeah. that you can get. Looks really good. 3G, not my favorite steel, but in a folder, it just might make sense. I just love the size of this. I use it absolutely yeah. every day so, of the week. But also, like when, sometimes when, I, when we order a pizza or something, the pizza is not sliced yeah, yet. Yeah, yeah. Grab Boom. out my knife. Boom. Yeah. Salad, but making salad. I love making salad. Pass. Opening boxes. My knife is pretty bulky. It's pretty heavy. I got rid of the uh, of the uh, pocket clip because yeah. it was it made it too bulky. But for me, I don't mind like a little bit of weight in my pocket. Yeah. If I have pants that are kind of tight fitting, yeah. I I would rather have something like that or a bug out or whatever. But for me, 99% of the time, especially in winter when I have a jacket on, yeah. this is perfect. And I just really love the fact that I have a folder that actually has a full convex. That's I, crazy. I think, it's, that. I think it's funny that um, two knife guys have a knife channel about fixed blades. Yeah. The knives that we use the most are two little folders. Yeah, but it's also... With, with steel that we did kind of dislike. But, yeah. that but I also, that's one thing I want to say about this steel. I love how long it stays sharp i mean that's pretty okay <laughs> but it chips it chips a little bit it's got little microchips and they, those yeah. come pretty fast yeah so i don't really like the steel for outdoor use like we said but so hey Falkneven, tk3 you know mother of film making it cos and this will yeah. be the perfect knife ever hey let us know in the comments what kind of edc you carry because it's interesting for us to read hey and check us out 1 pm pdt every thursday hit the like button if that's something that you like to do if you like the dbk compound spray you might want to check out our shop. Yeah. But if you don't... If you like really nice pictures, check out Instagram. If you like me... Subscribe! If you like me, check out my OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs>